Oh my goodness, I have to like oh, unbutton my pants so that I can sit down. <laughs> anyway, these are not sitting pants, but we're here. Hello, how are you? My name's Kiana, if you're new here. Also, look at this, look at this little hairstyle I did. I'm actually so proud of myself. I'm so excited. I, this is the first time I've ever, like, I don't know, I was just messing around with hairstyles and usually I don't do stuff like this and I saw it on my Pinterest and I was like, I have to try it now. I'm obsessed with bows. I even bought ribbons for this. Mmm. Hello lighting, hello gorgeous. Anyways, how are you guys doing? I missed you guys. <sighs> okay, today I'm just going to play around with makeup, I believe. I have quite a few new products that kind of came in the mail and I'm excited just to mess with them. Viewfinder, not, wait, camera, lens, not viewfinder. I still have a really hard time not looking at that. Holy gee, it's hot down here. <sighs> it's toasty. I haven't put on any skincare yet today, and I don't exactly know the order of all these road products, but I've heard really, really great things about them. And the makeup that I want to do today, I kind of want it to replicate somewhere in between Matilda Jerf and Sabrina Carpenter. Glowy foundation, but not foundation, lots of blush. Cause I feel like it's just like a cute girl vibe today. And I need, I just need to do that. Can we talk about Rhodes packaging? They sent me this PR and I am like, what the heck, actually, first of all, because that's insane that I get PR. And thank you guys for watching, because if I didn't have you guys, I probably would not be getting, I wouldn't be getting PR. There's not even a probably, like, I, it literally wouldn't happen. Anyways, so thank you. Glazing milk. I think the glazing milk goes on first, then this, then this, or this, then this. I don't know. I'm just, that's what we're doing. We're playing around today. So let's. Do I have things in my teeth, you guys? I ate dino nuggets earlier. Oh, if you are curious about this hairstyle, even though it's pretty self-explanatory, I did do a, I did film my entire process on TikTok. So, off to a good start, I think, I think. <laughs> Y'all should see the way I'm sitting, hold on. Look, I'm sitting like this. I should probably just change jeans. Oh, hello, you guys got close. Oh, you're getting closer. How are you? Take me on a date. I know that Matilda Jerf uses Rode products. I've seen it multiple, multiple times. I also know that she uses the Say Glowy Gel. I still need to get a big one of these. Yeah, so that is what we're going to try and do today. After AM, PM cleansing, glaze face with one or two pumps, avoid eye area. Did I do this in the wrong steps? That, I like that noise, even though that took forever. <laughs> I like that, I like that a lot. I like that laugh. <laughs> Hello. I kind of hate using new products, so this may turn out terrible. How? Oh, okay. Avoid eye area. Noted. How is my battery already on 3%? Riddle me that. I have three songs from Olivia Rodrigo's new album stuck in my head, of which involve, where did I put? losing my mind already. Oh, there it is, okay. What is it, Ballad of a Homeschooled Girl, I think? And then Get Him Back, obviously, because banger. And then I really, really like, there's one I listen to today. I don't like to listen to albums all the way through, it weirds me out, so I take forever to listen through an album. Oh, Love is Embarrassing, that's the one that I like. As long as these products don't give me little tiny bumps, not gonna lie, I could see myself adding these into my everyday routine. I have heard that these do have like nut oil or something in them, so if you're allergic to nuts, stay away. Because I heard that she didn't specifically say that in any of her videos or any of her marketing or even online, which is extremely dangerous. So that's a little concerning. But yeah, I've heard that. Still fact check me. I'm not completely sure. I just remember seeing a girl on TikTok. She was having an allergic reaction to these products. All right, I think I'm gonna let this settle in. I'm gonna change my camera battery and then we will continue. Five minutes later. Starting off, like I said, I'm going to use the Say Glowy Gel, even though I feel like my skin is already looking really good. I'm going to just use a few pumps of this. Trying to make sure that whatever I'm doing though, I'm not gonna make my face pill. Should I zoom you guys in? Would that be better? Oh, don't forget the eyes. I feel like I should go on live more because I was just thinking about this and I'm talking to you guys like you're there, which you are, you know, you're watching this at home, which is really cool. Thank you very much. I think that's really awesome. But at the same time, I would like to actually chit chat with you guys because I'm just kind of making my own answers up in my head. So 
This is kind of feeling like a self-reflection type exercise that my therapist would give me, which is okay. I am going in with the Glossier Perfecting Skin Tint. This is in G9. I think they changed their color palettes or something, like the way that they label everything. At least they did with the concealer because I went in looking for the concealer and I could not find it. Uh. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. The products are producting. Is that a phrase? <laughs> If my hair and my makeup go right today, I am scared for the next week. Things like this don't happen. Things like that don't happen. Oh, I got other things that are new. Hold on. How could I forget? I did. I went to the store and I got the e.l.f. Halo Glow Beauty Wand Contour Stick because as much as I love my Merit Stick, I wanted to try something new. So we're going to try this. Hopefully this isn't too dark. Tan light or something just didn't look like it would fit. Ooh, that might have been too much. A little on the nose, a little on the chin. Let's see. Oh, I look crazy. <gasps> Bruh. Ooh, that might have been too much. That's really dark. Ah, oh, did I? <gasps> Hold on. I can save this. I'm going to. Okay. <gasps> Y'all. I wasn't expecting it to be that pigmented. We're going to make it work. We, how? Don't ask me. Is it gonna be too dark? You dumb bit. Yes, it's too dark. I always think I'm tanner than I am. I feel like it's because usually in summertime or like towards the end of summer, I am actually really tan. But this summer, I just did not do that. All right, well, we said we were going for bronzy and blushy, but see, I feel like this side turned out way better. Okay, well, e.l.f. was definitely popping off. I get why this product is so viral. <laughs> I don't know why I haven't bought that sooner. Actually, I really do love it. I think I just needed to, you know, calm the heck down. Yeah, this side looks like someone punched the heck out of my face. Originally was not underpainting, but I guess that's what we're doing today. Try and help that section out at least. Okay, be honest. Did I fix it or did I make it worse? I think I fixed it. My biggest fear of trying new products is products being patchy. That's terrifying because I feel like I finally figured out what products I like and which ones aren't patchy. Ooh, and it's scary to go back. Next up, I'm going to go in with my concealer. I'm just going in with tried and true Glossier stretch concealer. I use the brush just to apply it into its right place. And then, like I said in some of my lash videos, I just think that using the warmth of your finger is so much better for Glossier products. Oh, my stomach started hurting. I actually have really, really bad gut issues. This is completely beside the point. Don't all girls, all women have like serious gut issues. Anyways, I'm in the process of figuring out what is wrong. I'm fairly sure that I have celiac disease. I'm already gluten-free. I've been gluten-free for like 10 years, you know, longer than that, actually closer to 14 because I was told I was gluten tolerant when I was really little, but I kind of just want to get checked out again because I have so many stomach problems. I'm always talking about how my stomach hurts and I think all of my friends are getting annoyed. <laughs> it's probably from my dino nuggets, even though they are gluten free. There's something else in them that my body didn't like. Chef's kiss. Glossier does not ever do me wrong. However, I've never tried their bronzer. I've heard nothing good about their bronzer. I did also get a new blush product because I wanted, I don't have like any sort of like pinky pinky blush. I do have, well, actually that's a lie. I do have this one. That's fairly pinky, but I kind of wanted to try this Juvia's Place one because I kept seeing them. Oh. <sighs> oh. Bro, what is, what is Juvia putting on these things? Super glue? Am I going crazy? I'm gonna have to ask my roommate to open this. <sighs> BRB. That took me a little too long. And I'll just do a section by section. How much was that? Oh, I had the email to me. I will have it listed up on, but I'm pretty sure like this was not that expensive, I wanna say. And I mean, you see it, <laughs> you can see it, right? It is beautiful. Yep. I've been trying to stop pulling my blush in so far. I'm trying to like, I go to the middle of my eye and then I go out because otherwise I feel like it gets really crazy and then my entire face kind of looks red. I'm going to pat this over my eyelids as well. Ah! Ah! Stunning! Stunning! Stunning. Who is it that says that? Whoever it is, I love her. I can't remember. Oh, she always has like the classical music playing behind her videos and she has lovely nails and her skin always looks really pretty. I can't remember her name right now. I follow her on everything, but I can't remember her name. Just to go over because I know that blush lasts the least. I'm going in, this is the Hourglass palette. I swear by this palette. I kind of just like drag these four colors together because they're like highlight and a blush and they just make everything 
look so damn pretty. I'm gonna throw up. This is so pretty. Okay. I'm going to do brown eyeliner in the eyes because I want them to look big today. Did I just? Y'all, can you see that? I just drug eyeliner all the way across my contact. I'm an idiot. I've had contacts for so long that I feel like I could touch them and I wouldn't even know. Anyways, I'm gonna do like the babiest of baby wings. The way I do wings is I just like put a little bit and then I, I like stretch it out and then clean it up with my finger. I don't know if that makes sense, but that's what I do. <laughs> it works so well, so why not? Okay, I'm kind of curious. Should I do a little bit under my eye? I mean, it's just brown. Cute. Oh, cute. Okay, cute. Are you doing your makeup with me? Because that actually would be really cute if you're doing your makeup with me. I would really love that. You should do your makeup with me. I should have said that at the beginning of the video. I am going to kind of like take these colors again and like sweep them over, specifically the highlight. I'm going to curl these lashes because I barely have any. If you guys have any tips and tricks for eyelashes and making them to grow, please tell me because mine don't want to grow and I've tried eyelash serums and they make my entire eye brown. I, like it makes, I don't know, it makes my eyes really irritated so I can't use them. Onto mascara. Hee <laughs> hee. I think I also just want them tinted and lifted. I know that tinting them probably won't do too much because I already have basically black eyelashes, but I think that lifting them definitely would. Me having to blink 20 times because I probably just have an accumulation of makeup in my eyes. Bizarre. I don't know how similar these two are. Mm, they're not really that similar. Okay, I think I'm gonna try and use this which is Charlotte Tilbury in Hollywood Honey and lightly, very, very lightly outline. It's just kind of a new product. I've had it for like a few days and that's it. I kind of like a blurry lip line. I don't know if that makes sense, but I feel like it makes my lips look bigger. I am overlining a little, kill me. Sue me. Okay, now I'm going in with this one. Like, tell me that's not the plumpiest. You're, you can't. You're, you're, you're mom. You can't tell me because I'm right. I know I'm right. To finish it off, I'm in between. I just was sent the new road. This is her newest one. Yeah, the strawberry glaze. Honestly, I'm kind of giving a little strawberry vibes, so I, I think that this would be cute. Just the tiniest bit. <laughs> the makeup is makeuping. Uh, oh, I need my setting spray, and then I think. Oh, I didn't even do my eyebrows. I'm just gonna brush them up with a little bit of gel. I'm letting these bad boys grow out, which I know sounds whack because they're already quite bushy, but. Bushy, 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 but I want them bushier. Y'all, I'm in a good ass mood today. Hair, makeup. Should I do freckles? Okay, I'm gonna do freckles. I think I'm gonna do them off camera though, and then I'll be right back. Okay, and that is the final look, ladies and gentlemen. I am in love. I am so freaking excited. That was actually, ah! That was so fun. Okay, um, so we should meet up again next week sometime and do this again because chit-chatting is fun. Yeah, maybe I should just do more little hairstyles because this just put me in the best mood ever. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Hugs, kisses, love you. Bye-bye. <laughs>